Hey guys, welcome to my room. Okay, today we're gonna film what's in my what? pouch. Today I am going to film what's in my travel pouch. And come follow me to the bathroom. To the makeup room. That sounds better. Ta da! Now. I just decided to film what's in my pouch, like like my travel pouch, because the bathroom is just so amazingly beautiful. So I have two pouches. One is the one that I share with Jonas and mostly skincare products and all the other Jonas stuff. And this is my makeup. So let's see what I've got here. I'm just going to start with uh, the skincare one. This is my first product. It's from L'Occitane Broom f I don't know, Fresh Face and Body Mist. Zoom in, please. I'm zoomed all in. Uh, I don't think you can use it instead of toner. I'm not really sure about it. But. Mmm. Smells like rose. Hydrates my skin pretty well. <laughs> my skin is just so dry. I'm feeling dry, dry. Okay. Next one. I also brought this um, CMP Propolis Energy Ampoule. Uh, I just didn't want to bring anything that is too heavy on my face because I thought it will be really, really hot and greasy. But actually it turned out that my face is actually drier than in Korea. I just tried to bring everything that I don't really use in Korea or something like I have in a small size something like this, like this is moisturizer from Ground Plan. I have no clue what I thought that this small tube will be enough for two of us for a week. When are we leaving? Tomorrow? No. Day after tomorrow. Just in case moisturizer, actually for your eyes, but you can apply it apparently all over your face. And it's really cheap. Like you can buy this thing on the internet for like five, six dollars. And it's really, really rich, so uh, <coughs> sorry guys, I just thought it will be good for me to bring I also got here Innisfree BJC Kaban This is uh, for my husband, I don't really use it anymore When I travel, I really try not to have too many products in my pouch Because I just hate like carrying stuff with me <coughs> Glossier Zit Stick This is like emergency pimple killer so I had like huge acne growing under my nose again and I applied it for like one day and it disappeared literally. It's gone! Is it still red? Mm, a little bit. A little bit. But my cleansing oil, uh, it's Bobbi Brown Soothing Cleansing Oil and I just got this little pump from Daiso. I also got here some scrubs. Rice powder polish from I think it's Nine Wishes. So in this one little container there is um, enough amount for one use. Hair product, Tsubaki All Perfection Hair Oil. I just thought for travel, it will be better to use oil uh, than the cream, the Rene Fructier cream that I usually use. And um, because I can use it like a lot. But with the Rene Fructier, I just feel like I don't want to use it too much because it's expensive. Also, we got here some Jonas Arbochev. And everything else is honestly just medicine. My choice of perfume for this travel is Jomala Lime Basil and Mandarin because um, mosquitoes don't really like this like lemony kind of fragrance, right? No? Lemongrass. Pretty class. Mosquito repellent and aloe vera. <coughs> for the sunscreen, excuse me, follow me. Back, 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 back. Alright, uh, sunscreen. I brought this huge one from Mecca Cosmetica. Dumb, because it's not. It's not waterproof. It's not waterproof. I thought it could be good enough. You know? And it's like really huge. And also, this is. What is it? Australian Gold. SPF 8. It's only SPF 8. Like, this is the only product that I could find in Korea. It smells like bubblegum. I don't really like the smell. Like, all the other products that I used to use smell like coconut oil. What's that brand called? 
and it but comes it's really good yeah it's good and it comes in a different spf range 15 30 yeah. but this one has only eight it's too low i think for korean sun uh, yeah korean sun is not strong enough so it's good all right let's move on to this more exciting bag it's glossy air polish and this is all my makeup i don't know why i brought so many makeup this is my eye jobs and it's must have for me especially when i go to the tropical countries tweezer tweeze out my eyebrows armpit hair and all the other stuff so this time i brought this glossier skin perfecting ah, perfecting skin tint uh the shade is in dark so let's see how it looks on my face now because before it was quite dark but i'm pretty tight now so should be fine it's slightly bright on my skin now but anyways it doesn't have that much of coverage so um, not much pigmentation so it's quite invisible uh, perfecting skin tint uh, you better use your fingers probably it's the best if you use your fingers kind of like melt the product and gives you a really nice glow look at that look at that whoa Honestly, I brought too much makeup for traveling for the blush today. Uh, I brought these two products from Glossier Cloud Paint. One is Beam and the other one is Puff. And I think I like Puff more. And I think it suits my gown today better. It was fight. It wasn't fight. See, I can do it again. You can fight again too. Okay. Just gonna dab, 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 dab. I'm soaking to just finish this filming and go watch Adventure Time Alright, for the powder, I don't uh, really wear powder here but sometimes my face feels like too greasy setting my makeup around my eyes T-zone and wherever I have lots of wrinkles like here, that's it um, I also purchased this time in a duty free MAC Shape Plus Shade Bro Tint in top this is how you read top 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 it's honestly invisible you can't really notice it because it's really sheer but i will still draw like tiny little strokes especially in the front of my eyebrows because it feels like my eyebrows are too far away from each other and i want them to make it look a bit more bushy you can notice that my eyebrow over here is really messy I didn't pull my eyebrows here because I just want them to look a bit more natural these days Glossier Boy Brow in Blonde My hair is not blonde anymore but anywho This product worked better when I first tried it Now it just doesn't really set my eyebrow hair as good as it did at the first I don't know if any one of you guys tried eyelash curling, like eyelash pum. Perm. Perm. How is it? Let me know your opinion. Do you think it's worth it? For the eyeshadow, I don't wear it every day, but I wore it yesterday for our anniversary dinner. Nature Republic Pro Touch Stick. Uh, Pro Touch Color Master Stick Shadow in Mocha Cookie. So I just use my fingers to blend it. It's not really noticeable, honestly, especially after my really nice tan. And mascara. I purchased this Manila Co. Vanilla Co. Uh, Be by Vanilla. Oh, they changed their name. Be by Vanilla. I Crush Circle Volume Mascara. This is, I think, the same product with what they had before the blue one. The I think it's called Foxtail Mascara Waterproof. Uh, it actually has the same wand exactly the same I think it's pretty good mascara for um, Rochab brand couldn't really find any other like um, non expensive mascaras that I really like it especially with this skinny type of one so let's just put a bit of mascara do you think there. yeah <clears throat> do you think you could buy a whole makeup set for ten dollars no mana no darling even at lobs no how much what's the minimum you think you need on like, my none? depends on like what can you give up you know like 
basic essentials for like a high school student. Cushion, blush, lip tint, eyebrow, mascara. 50 bucks? Oh, 50 bucks at least? I don't even know if you can buy something for 50 bucks because cushions are already like 20, 30 bucks. Just makes me look like I got really nice sun, like sun-kissed look. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I forgot about this. I actually brought so much makeup, I didn't even know. Okay, this is Pat McGrath Labs A yeah, new shiny stick. So um, I use only this highlighter. There is nothing that I like over this one. So I'm just applying the bum part and tap 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 and then the highlighter again tap 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 a little bit here, here, and on my cupid, but what I left on my finger. Also, I could use this, but nah, it skips. I already got enough of bronze there on my face. Natural bronze. For the lip, I got this Glossier lip gloss. I actually really like Glossier products. I think they are perfect for traveling. There are a few other products that I just brought by not realizing that I have them just like this, this, this I didn't even know that I brought them but I think they were in my bag or something okay, that's it should we go outside and show myself in the nicer sunlight? Thanks for watching and I will see you again in my next video. Bye bye!